नमस्ते स्टूडेंट टूडल गोइंग टू सी द प्रॉब्लम बेस्ड ऑन योर लीनियर पियर्स स्ट्रेट एंगल प्रॉपर्टी एंड वर्टिकली ऑपोजिट एंगल सो यर वी हैव फोर प्रॉब्लम्स तो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद द फर्स्ट वन यर यू कैन सी दैट यो बी इज ए स्ट्रेट लाइन एंड देर आर टू एंगल्स ओके सो हियर वी हैव फर्स्ट वन सो इन दिस केस जस्ट वट वील गोइंग टू सी वील गोइंग टू राइट हियर एक्सो प्लस टू एक्स प्लस फाइव इक्वल्स टू वन हंड्रेड एट्टी विल से एंड बिसाइड दिस विल राइट हियर रीजन लीनियर पेयर ओके नाउ यू प्रोसीड एज इन द लीनियर इक्वेशन यू हैव डन द जूनियर क्लासेस थ्री एक्स एंड हियर वी हैव प्लस फाइव इक्वल्स टू वन हंड्रेड एट्टी सेंड दिस वन दैट साइड दैट इज वन हंड्रेड एट्टी माइनस फाइव वी आर गेटिंग वन हंड्रेड सेवेंटी फाइव सो एक्स इक्वल्स टू वन हंड्रेड सेवेंटी फाइव बाई थ्री दिस इज योर आंसर यू कैन कीप योर आंसर इन अ फ्रैक्शन ऑल्सो नो प्रॉब्लम ओके और सिंपलेस्ट फ्रैक्शन एज यू कैन सी दैट इट विल नॉट बी डिवाइडेड बाई एनी यू कैन कीप इट इन दिस फॉर्म और यू कैन कीप इट इन अ मिक्स फ्रैक्शन ऑल्सो ओके नेक्स्ट प्रोसीड फॉर द सेकेंड वन हियर वी हैव सो अवर डायग्राम so a o b is a straight line and then we have c and d where this is your 2x 3x plus 2 30 and 4x plus 8 you can see that this is a straight line and this is also a straight line but in the first case we are taking linear pair pair is there much two angle and a straight line then we need to write here linear pair if we'll write a straight angle property also then also correct but look at here in this case you cannot write here linear pair why sir because it's a straight line but you can see that there are more than two angles that means pair is not there okay linear pair means two edges angle should be there but here you can see that three angles so in this case what we're going to do we have 4x plus 8 plus 30 degree plus 3x Plus two equals to one hundred eighty. We'll write, but beside here we're going to write here straight angle property. Okay. Now you proceed. Here we have four x plus this is seven x, and uh, we are getting thirty plus ten forty minus we are getting one hundred forty by seven. So x equals to twenty degree. Okay, this is our answer for second one. Here we have third problem. Uh, take it here as a O. That means A O B or or you can say that A B intersect C D at O. Now you need to find the value of x. We know that they are vertically opposite angle and vertically opposite angle are equal. So what we're going to write third in third case? Just you draw the diagrams. Right now I am not drawing here, but you do. Here we have two x plus five equals to what? Sixty-five. Reason we'll write vertically opposite angles. Now you solve it. What we are getting? Two x that is sixty-five minus five. We're getting sixty. X equals to sixty by two. Thirty. Thirty we are getting x equals to thirty degree. Okay, this is your answer for fourth one, not fourth one, third one. Now we proceed for the fourth one. You can see that the fourth one is quite similar to your second one. Why, sir? Because if we we'll close this two part, if we we'll close this two part, you can see that F O E is a straight line, and this shows the same thing. No need to worry. That means what we're going to do here. Here, just we need to write. We have. We have F O E is a straight line. Therefore, you can see that one one zero plus four x plus three x will give you one hundred eighty degree. And mention here straight. Angles property. 
the question will as so in the first one you have not written here foe and in the second case you are writing here foe as you can see that there are three lines and in this case you can see that only one line is there so if i mentioned a straight angle property that means there is a, only a straight line but if you look at here there are so many straight line now so many means three foe aob cod then if i write mentioned here and straight angle property then which lines you are taking which line you are going to take that's why we need to mention that foe we are taking here straight line and using this straight angle property we are adding this now you add it what we are getting here 7x 180 next 7x equals to 180 minus 110 we are getting here 70 by 7 10 we are getting x equals to 10 degree this is your answer okay thank you